There is no Amazon.com for boundary surveys. Why not? You know, why isn't why can't why can't you go on a you know cheapsurveys.com and just order up a boundary survey for your project? Well, I want I just want to tell you guys right at the beginning of the video, I love Amazon way too much. Um, so I do all kinds of shopping on Amazon. I love the fact that I can click a button and have the stuff I want show up on my doorstep the same day or the next day. I spend way too much money on Amazon. I, I buy way too many books on Amazon. Um, so the purpose of this video is, is not to trash talk Amazon, okay? But part of what Amazon has done is, it, is it's taught people, it's taught American consumers that everything in life, they, when, whatever they need in life, they should be able to just, they should be able to buy it just like they buy on Amazon, right? And I don't think that's true. So could you have an Amazon.com for boundary surveys? And isn't that what people want? Why can't you just go online, you know, read a couple reviews, um, enter your street address, click a button, and get a survey. Okay, so you're on, you're not going to be able to order a good boundary survey on a on a site like Amazon.com, and I want to explain why. Okay, so I'm going to give you um, three reasons why four four reasons sorry four reasons why you're not going to be able to get your boundary survey on a, on a site like Amazon.com, and and I'm not this is I'm not making this up. These are, these are real reasons why it just doesn't work. Okay. So here's the first, the first reason why. You're not really buying a product when you go to get a boundary survey. You're buying a service, right? I'm a, I'm a land surveyor. I'm a professional service provider, okay? I'm not selling you a product. Now, you may get some type of work product as part of the process, okay? But you're really buying a professional service. So buying a boundary survey is more like hiring an architect to design your custom home or hiring a lawyer to give you uh, legal advice for your business, it's it's more similar to that than it is going down to um, to Walgreens to buy a toothbrush. Okay, way it's we're not you're not buying a product, you're buying a professional service. Okay, so that's the first reason why. The second reason why you're not going to be able to order a good survey on on a site like Amazon.com is each boundary survey is unique, and I talk about that in some other videos. Why is each boundary survey unique? Well, each boundary survey is unique because each Parcel of real estate is unique. Okay, now there's some general rules that we follow when, when we do boundary surveying, but the rules are specific to states and local jurisdictions, and there's a, a local history involved sometimes. And every parcel is a unique is unique. It's like a fingerprint, right? There are no two parcels exactly the same anywhere in the United States. So that's part of the reason why. You can't just go and shop for a boundary survey on Amazon.com, right? I like a lot of times I have people call me and they say, "Hey, how much is it to get my parcel surveyed?" Uh, zero to a million dollars? Like I don't know. I need more information, right? Where is your parcel? What are you trying to do? You know, how big is your parcel? What is the terrain like? When was the last time it was surveyed? Are the property corner monuments set? Like I have to ask all kinds of questions before I can tell you how much a boundary survey is. So, uh, each boundary survey is unique. The third reason is boundary surveys can be used for different purposes. Okay, so um, sometimes people just want to build a fence. Other times people need to, to they want to build a, a home or a, or a warehouse or a, a, t a film studio, right? It just, there's all kinds of different things you can do with a boundary survey and that changes, you know, what we have to do when we perform the survey. Uh, we need to know how you're going to use it, how the survey is going to be used. Okay, so... Boundary surveys can be used by different different professions for different reasons. So it's not like a toothbrush. You know, basically only one or two things you can do with a toothbrush, right? You can clean your teeth or you can clean the tile on your kitchen counter. Like those are the two things you can do with the toothbrush, right? So boundary surveys aren't like toothbrushes. There's all kinds of different things you can do with them. And then the fourth reason you're not going to be able to get a good boundary survey on a site like Amazon.com is because you just you can't do one-day delivery on boundary surveys. You just can't. It's impossible. I'm just telling you right now, I don't care how good you are. I don't care how many people you have working for you. There's no way to turn around a good boundary survey in one day, okay? Um, not unless you cheat somehow. So those are the four reasons why um, you can't buy a boundary survey on a site like Amazon.com. Now, I'll tell you, there's some companies that are trying to do that. They're trying to be the Amazon.com of boundary surveying. Who are these folks? Well, it's usually um, what we call Alta Survey Brokers. Okay, so these are these are kind of middlemen. Um, there's three or four of these firms. Most of them are back back in the eastern part of the United States. And what they do is they put together lists of, of land surveyors in different states, and then you call them for an Alta Survey, and they go out and they and they run down their list and they find the cheapest price they can get 
for the boundary survey. Call them Alta Survey Brokers. Okay, um, but you'll notice I said you can't get a good boundary survey on a site like Amazon.com. Those guys are not giving you a good product. I've seen the surveys; they're garbage. You're wasting your money on them, right? And now the the, the new thing that we have, relatively recent, is we've we've had some national land title companies get into this kind of Alta Survey broker business, and so they're they're trying to kind of run the same model. So they're like, hey, we'll give you your title report and your title survey at the same time, okay? But they're running the same kind of model. And how do I know this? Because I've asked, I've been asked by these companies to be on their low bid list, and I and I refuse to do it. Um, good surveyors don't do that kind of work. So, uh, it, I'm not saying you won't find a site that's trying to be the Amazon.com of boundary surveys, but you're not going to get a good boundary survey there for all of the reasons that I just mentioned. Okay. So, what's the result of these folks that are trying to to make an Amazon.com for boundary surveys? Well, they produce low cost, low quality, toxic. Surveys, that's what they do. And oftentimes those surveys create more problems than they solve. Okay, so don't get caught into that trap. Don't shop for your next boundary survey on a site like Amazon, like you're trying to buy a toothbrush, right? You're not buying a toothbrush, you're, you're buying a professional service and you're, you're probably in the market for a survey because you're about to make a huge investment into a parcel of real estate. So if you're gonna do that, you wanna, you wanna shop for that service provider just like you do an architect that's gonna design your building or a lawyer that's gonna help you uh, handle legal issues with the business or a, a, a surgeon that's gonna, that's gonna put in a new knee or you know, new, uh, take out a, a, a brain tumor. Like you, you, wouldn't go, you wouldn't go get that stuff on amazon.com for good reasons. So the same thing applies to a good boundary survey.